Hey guys, we're Time6 back watching Naruto. This is episodes 91 and 92. If you enjoy our videos, make sure to leave a like, comment down below your thoughts, and remember to subscribe for future uploads. You can also check out our Patreon page where you can get early access and the full uncut reactions up to six episodes ahead. Link is going to be down below. Help support the channel by checking that out. And let's get started right away. Good luck, buddy. Jeez! Oh, good. Good. <laughs> A crack finger? Unbelievable. I never expected the fourth Hokage's jutsu. Still, it's not like the real thing. Not coming from this. Are you the one who taught this little kid the Rasengan? Rasengan? Well, of course I did. I'm his teacher, aren't I? What of it? Ha! Huh. You and the fourth Hokage are the only ones who can use that jutsu. What's the point of teaching it to someone who can never master it, you old fool? Damn. Giving him false hopes like that. Filling his head with stupid oh, ideas. No. Making him think he could actually be Hokage someday. Oh, no. Oh. I'll show you who's stupid. Just wait. <laughs> just wait. Give me just three days and I'll have that jutsu down three flat. Things. You Why won't. You I guarantee you. Challenge accepted. I said it and I never go back on my word. That's my Nindo, my ninja way. Care to make a bet? Is there a repair the Oh no. Right. I'll give you one week. If you can master that jutsu by then, I'll admit I'm wrong and that you're worthy of becoming Hokage. I'll even throw in my necklace. Lady Tsunade, no! No, you don't really mean that! Ah, you can keep it. I'm not really into jewelry. You numbskull. <laughs> That necklace belonged to the first Hokage himself. Oh. There are only two like it in the world. Why, sure. that little thing is worth three gold mines in the mountains on top of- Gold mines? <laughs> Damn. Damn. Lady, you've got yourself a bet. <laughs> if you don't master oh. it in a week, you lose and admit I was right. And That's I it? I get the money in Froggy. Ah, uh, Nakama! Wait That's a second. She's joking. She's not going to do it. She just wants him to learn. Let's go, Shizune. Is she no drunk? how bad yeah. things got, she's never bet the necklace before. Oh, she's giving up. Don't decide now. But we'll expect your answer within the week. Oh, the week. Hmm. The day she lost all she had. Dreams, hopes, everything. She had nothing left after that. Except the necklace and all of its memories. Please understand, that necklace is more precious than life for her. It's not simply a piece of jewelry to be gambled away on a silly bet. Look, a bet's a bet. Anyway, <laughs> it was her idea, Fair. not mine. It was her idea. Sorry, if you think it's something you'll be able to wear like a trophy, this is not just any necklace. It won't accept anyone else wearing it. What? Only on Lady Tsunade does it remain no. safe. Hmm. When anyone else puts it on, they die. Die. Maybe that's the catch. She wants. Yeah. If he can do it, she wants him to die. Sister, is this what I think it is? Yep. It belonged to our grandfather, the necklace of the first Hokage. I love you! <laughs> Take good care of it. Oh, I will, and not just the necklace. This entire village meant a lot to our grandfather. And I'm gonna take good care of all of it. You always say, a man never goes back on his word. Right. <gasps> and I give my word, I'll follow our grandfather's footsteps. The same words like Naruto used. Mm -hmm. To Maybe be that's Hokage. Why. That is my dream. If Naruto had his voice, he'd be less annoying. Right? No, it's best if you don't look, Tsunade. <sighs> what difference can it make? The condition the body's in. She won't even be able to recognize her little brother. Silence, Orochimaru! No way. This is what happens in war. Shinobi are just left on the battlefield to die. There are no doctors or healers to help them. It's too bad the boy was so reckless. As if he thought he were invulnerable. And the day after receiving such a lovely gift to... One day after? Is it like, like a curse? So that kiss wasn't a charm. It was a curse. Yeah. And we're in the midst of a great war. Such an undertaking would require time and resources. And our enemies won't sit back and wait for us. <sighs> so we do nothing? We That's go all he on said. throwing their lives away? I agree. I say she's right. If we can learn to save future generations of Shinobi, then those who've died, perhaps this way their deaths will have meaning. It's getting late. 
Would you like me to see you home? Oh. Ooh. Don't you? Isn't your house? Mm hmm. The other way. Don't bother, really. Oh, it's no bother. I wanted to talk to you anyway. Besides, I love this walk and all its memories. It's the way I used to go to pick my little sister up at the academy. That night a year ago, when the village was attacked, my sister was killed. Well, so him too. We're the same. I love this village and the people in it with all my heart. I want to protect them. I want to lead them in building a better world than this. It's been my dream ever since my sister died. To be Hokage. That is my dream. What is everyone's We're learning dream? a lot of people have that dream. Oh, she's gonna kill him too? <gasps> she's a fucking... What? If she, he dies, she's a curse. I want you to have it. Oh wait, no, it's the necklace! She's a snake. The necklace is the curse. Tsunade. I don't want to die yet. There are so many things left to do. Don't try to talk! What? Hang on! No! She's been in torment ever since. Where are you going? Out. I need to start training. Oh, this could help. If he gets the necklace and doesn't die, it's gonna mean something. He breaks the curse. I have to say, I never imagined that you'd still have that necklace after all these years. I just assumed you would have gambled it away long before now. Guess it's all you have to remember them by. You'll never be able to master that jutsu in a week, and you know it. It's not much of a bet. Why so glum, anyway? Who's glum? I don't know what you're talking about. It's glum for the rum. When are you meeting Orochimaru again? Oh! I can see it in Shizune's face. I don't know what sort of deal he may have offered you, but think carefully before accepting it. It's only thanks to them that the village has survived, even prospered, through troubled times. This was their dream, and they were all willing to gamble everything to achieve it. Gamble? Even their lives. Betray that dream and you make all their sacrifices meaningless. Damn! Why am I saying this? Could you do such a thing? If I thought you could, I would stop you right here and now. Damn! Right? To be Hokage! It's a different haircut. That is my dream. And no makeup on. And the eyes. You're still just a Genin, so if there's ever a real battle, you get out of there fast. Are you crazy? <laughs> I'm never gonna run away! Well. They're more alike than you know. What do you plan on doing once your arms have been restored to you? This time around, I'm going to grind the Hidden Leaf Village into dust. My lady! Think of your brother! Think of my uncle! It would be a betrayal of them! A betrayal of yourself! Have you forgotten all your dreams? I'll cut to the chase. Tsunade, in all its wisdom, the village has come to the decision to name you as the fifth Hokage. Oh. Alright guys, we're gonna start episode 92 now. If she agrees to our proposition, then your arms will be healed. And you can proceed with your plan to destroy the village hidden in the leaves. And Lady Tsunade is reunited with the two people she loves most. But if she should say no, what then? Then I'd simply use force to bend her to my way of thinking. In all the world, there is no one who knows Tsunade better than I. Including her greatest weakness. She'll agree to the proposition. I guarantee it. Damn, a guarantee? In other words, keeping the power and the rotation of your chakra at their maximum. I get it. I can see it in my head. Mm. But no matter how hard I try, I just can't focus all my chakra into a neat little ball. <laughs> Teaching it to someone who can never master it, giving him false hopes like that. What? Yeah, Max, doing okay? Well, how about right now? <laughs> this guy. You take care now. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Why can't I do it? 
Maybe have some rest, buddy. Eat it's something. Too late. Get some protein. Yeah. Out of time. This guy doesn't know what progressive overload is. <laughs> it's a lovely night. You want to quench your thirst? <laughs> Unless I'm wrong, the week you gave Naruto is up tomorrow, isn't it? I haven't seen him in days. Oh. Oh. Just oh. He's a snake. No, Rufy is ass. <sighs> wow. Here you go. Oh. Oh. Ah, now that looks delicious. <laughs> oh. He faked it. Yeah, you think? Yeah, they didn't show it going yeah. And his right hand is severely burned from concentrated chakra. Oh. He's out of it. He won't wake up till the day after tomorrow at the earliest. Old Jirai was right about me. To think I've sunk so low, I'd bet against a kid. Why don't you answer? Say something! Lady Tsunade, answer me! I need to know! Because if you tell me you're going, what then? I'm going to. I will try and stop you if it costs me my life. Whoa! Oh. Damn! Fair enough. Shizune, have you forgotten who you're talking to? <laughs> you punch her in the stomach. Wow. What the, the fuck she gave him? Oh man, you okay? No matter how beat up I get, just give me a good night's sleep and I'm right back at the top of my game. Besides, I've got a date to keep with that rotten old witch Tsunade. Today's the day I wipe that smirk off her face. Must have spiked my drink when I wasn't looking. I can't build up any chakra. Oh. My body is so weak. I don't think I can even throw a kunai straight. Great, pervy sage! And you're always going on about what a great ninja you are! What, yeah! You get distracted by her pretty face! Shut up! <laughs> it's time you told us about your mistress and Orochimaru. Do it! What kind of deal are they making? Orochimaru? There's no time to lose. You must come with me quickly. I'll explain on the way. Let's okay. go then. Don't forget me! I'm coming too! And don't forget me! <laughs> <laughs> oh, they were about to. <gasps> oh, oh, the Orochimaru music. Yep. <laughs> He's like fucking the Undertaker. <laughs> right? <laughs> he comes in. <laughs> uh oh. You give me no choice, Tsunade. If I have to kill you, I will. Damn. I will heal your arms. <gasps> but in exchange, you keep your hands off the village. <laughs> That's not gonna happen. Very the fuck? That's his, that's his main mission. Yeah. She so. He lied. This? Where's the contract? Right. Put it in writing. As soon as his arms are healed, Orochimaru is planning to destroy the Leaf Village. Of course, that's just what I'd expect. And trust me, he'll do far more than that if we don't manage to stop him somehow. Who does this creep think he is? He flying upside down. <laughs> <laughs> Oh! Wait, what? He did it! Why? Well, we got the flashback of killing. What is the meaning of this? Am I to understand you've really come here to betray me? The treachery! Two on one, come on. Kabuto and her had a deal, I think. Yeah, that's what it looked like. Okay, right, thanks for watching the reaction portion of the video. Make sure to stay tuned for the discussion if there's any part of the episode that we weren't able to keep in the YouTube edit. Click the link down below for the full uncut reaction over on Patreon. Let's discuss. So episode 90 and 91. So naughty. Hmm. You got her backstory with uh, brother-in-law, lover, whatever. No, just twin. <laughs> yeah. Favorite moment, um, honestly, it's lesson because I want to see what what it turns into. Yeah, yeah. Like, what is the treachery? Yeah. Um, also, the backstory was cool. Learning about Sonata. Uh, what I don't like was the roofie, bro. She Chill out on that. And, and attacking the assistant. Well, I mean, let's see how it goes, but... It could be part of yeah, maybe plan. part of the plan. Like yeah. she doesn't want to try to mess it up, you know. And I guess she had to attack her, 
Our system too. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah we'll see. So. Yeah, uh, my favorite scene was yeah, just the ending here. It's pretty much switched up the whole narrative here. So, I want to see what the deal here is between Kabuto and uh, the girl. You know, these favorite, I don't have one. Yeah. Yeah, I would say the ending is my favorite. I think we all kind of had a feeling that she wouldn't actually go through with this. Mm. But no one predicted that she, Kabuto was going to be part of it, right? That's kind of surprising. Yeah, it is. Um, she was debating it in her head, but I feel like, I don't know if she, anyone that was part of the Leaf Village, other than fucking Orochimaru, would be okay with destroying it, you know? That's that's too far. Even if it's like to bring back a love. But that's what she said. Uh, she changed the, oh. the, the the contract. She said she's gonna leave it alone. Yeah. Which I don't know why she would think he would, but mm -hmm. I guess she just wanted to see. Yeah. Because if if her plan was this all along. Might as well see if he says yes to that. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Trying to see if he lies, which he did. Because there's no way he's leaving the leaf village alone. Right. Like, no way at all. Also, the other thing is that I don't like is that Naruto looks like her brother. I think like they, that? this would have been better if they made him look different, but sound the same. Like, same ideas. You think it's same. too on the nose? Yeah, like, yeah, it's a little like weird. why the fuck would you bring this same exact animation but change the colors? Yeah, it's, it's a little just, weird. You have a different kid with the same, you know? I feel like there's a connection there. Like, it's fucking... Like, like biological like, connection? Yeah, like, his long mean, last brother or some shit. Exactly. That's Not why brother, maybe, like, a cousin or a... Could be, yeah. Yeah, yeah cousins look good. A brother would yeah. It would be too, too close. Too identical, like, it's kind of... It is too yeah. identical. They could be cousins. I could see cousins. Yeah. Because we don't know a lot about Naruto's family, so... We don't. Yeah. Like, first cousin, they could look like this, for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, we could talk about the flashbacks. Sure. Um, basically, this cursed necklace. Mm -hmm. Or cursed kiss. <laughs> Which do you think it is? <laughs> Curse necklace? Yeah, I believe it's both. Necklace. I think it's the combo. The combo? <laughs> the one, two? That combo is lethal. If she does yes. one, it's okay. Well, yeah, probably. Yeah. yeah, true. Maybe it is that. We don't know. Yeah, we don't know. Because uh, the lady said the, the necklace of uh, death or whatever, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that was the title. I thought it was uh, she said, like you actually like just die on some shit wear it, but. Well, it seems you something bad happens. Yeah, it's like a curse. Like a curse right, or like, yeah. mm -hmm. or maybe you die in battle. It is the next day. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's the next day, both yeah. times, right? Yeah. We're assuming that other one was also the next day, the lover. What if it's just a random like? <laughs> what do you mean? Or what if it's not a curse? Well, you just happen to die the next day. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, two. Two is not enough to say. It's two is a, not enough. That's not a pattern yet. It's not. Yeah. Uh, okay, but yeah, that's the backstory. Um, and we learned that she put into the the reform for the uh -huh. healers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's cool. And then we just get a bunch of floofing around. Naruto's trying to do the bet. Yeah. Um, Jiraiya is having his fun and keeping an eye out on Sonate. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's so easy to motivate Naruto. Just talk, Just talk shit. shit. <laughs> Tell him you're never gonna become Hokage if you don't do this. <laughs> he's and he's gonna do it. Just give him. A then he things. overtrains. Yeah. <laughs> well, even though he overtrained, he's able to. He, he's a super I mean, yeah. speedy yeah. recoverer. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. I wish I would recover that fast. Right. Bro. And yeah, now we're here in the end with a supposed bamboozle. Yeah, I can see Kabuto doing that. Man. He's such a snake. Mm -hmm. But it makes because I was wondering why they showed the flashback, right? Basically, Orochimaru was saying, if you don't mm -hmm. uh, kill me now, you'll never be able to because I'll just get so strong. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And now there's a situation where he can do something before yeah, it, yeah. Uh, Orochimaru gets 
super strong. Exactly. Because even back then when he said it, mm -hmm. I don't know if Kabuto wouldn't be able to take him out, I don't think. Mm -hmm. Probably not, no. Yeah. So, we'll see what happens. I don't think Kabuto fights, man. This guy just... He fights, we saw him. Yeah, he but like... He just shit. Yeah, he's more of a, like, I'm a little bit of shit. He's a plotter. Bounce, you know? And what? Back to yeah. Every time we see him fight, he's, like, with a group, right? Yeah. Like, why would he help fucking Orichimaru anyways? Guy's fucking useless right now. Well, you it know? depends on his motivations. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Does Kabuto want the Leaf Village yeah. destroyed? Oh, okay, so I know that last scene was insinuating that Kabuto and Sonata were working together. But what if they aren't? What if Kabuto did that because Orochimaru agreed not to attack the village? Uh, He's like, whoa, 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 this is not our plan. Right, right, right. What if that's the reason? Yeah. Like, I don't think it is, but I'm just throwing it out there. Could be. Yeah. Okay, thanks for watching our reaction for Naruto. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like and comment down below your thoughts. We'll see you in the next episode. Peace.